Namaste YouTube, welcome to Cafe Inoma and welcome to our reaction to Grateful Dead. We are going to react to the song Trucking and it's a request of our patron Michael. Um, it's been a long, 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 long time that we reacted to Grateful Dead. It's been a real long time. Yeah. yeah. And I'm eager to listen to the song Trucking. Um, I'm assuming trucking is... Uh, term for truckers? Yeah. Truck driving or going in a or the caravan, uh, like the RV vans. Maybe, maybe, maybe something like that. What do you think it's about? I think it should be something related to on the road. Yeah. And always wanting to be on the road, something like that. And uh, request coming from our patron Michael should be musically very interesting and special uh, because his choices have been very, uh, uh, very, very nice to listen to all this while. We give open, sincere and honest reviews of the songs we listen to. Our main purpose, our guiding light on an homage to react to music we've not heard before. And in case we've heard it, it should be something that is meaningful, thought-provoking and, you know, connects with us professionally and personally. Professionally, we are counsellors, teachers and life coaches. We work from home and we also are parents and family members living in Mumbai, India and a married couple. Yeah. So we react to music because of our passion for listening to music. But if it's also meaningful and it evokes a thought-provoking response from us or a meaningful response from us, all the better. So let's see what this one has to offer. Okay, Anything? what I would like to mention just before we start is we just reacted to Stevie Wonder and the song If It's Magic. I'm in a great mood. And that puts me in the double great mood to listen to this song and react to another new song for us. But all of you, if for some reason you haven't felt the magic yet before coming to this reaction, I hope it happens through this music and our reaction. So hope you guys enjoy this yeah. music as well as our reaction to it. Got my chips cashed in Keep trucking Like the doodah man Together More or less in line Just keep trucking On, on, on Arrows of neon and flashing my keys Out on Main Street Chicago, New York, Detroit And it's all on the same street a typical city involved in a typical daydream Hang it up and see what tomorrow brings Dallas got a soft machine Houston, too close to New Orleans New York got the ways and means And just won't let you be True love. Most of the time they're sitting and crying at home. One of these days they know they gotta get going. Out of the door and down to the street all alone. Chugging like the dude I man once told me you got to pay your hand. Sometimes the cards ain't worth a dime if you don't lay them down. Take a place to go and just keep trucking. 
and uh, vocals were very very uh, relaxing i don't know why this is rare times that i would say uh, uh, southern rock music relaxes me but that's how it was the guitars were good and the vocals were very laid back and relaxing i don't know if you can call this southern rock i think it would Some be more what i'm saying um, maybe not as classic rock yeah classic? i think classic rock you know i mean not that it's a very well defined genre of whatever i know mm. but i think this would be in classic in classic rock. okay uh, whichever genre it falls doesn't harm me at all i like the music um uh, one of the things that uh, you got to notice being an outsider is lot of places of america are mentioned in one song not too many songs actually mention so many places it's in a row lot of places were mentioned yeah and don't you think for an outsider like us i'm not we are knowledgeable outsiders but yeah. for most people from outside america mm-hmm. would they really connect with the song because most of the places it's a, it's a song for americans okay put it straight forward yeah they will connect to it That's, they would you know uh, uh, probably the playing the song and when they are on a long drive to the same routes they would be even happier they would be in cloud 9 that uh, this is a song made for us i am going for this kind of a ride or something like yeah, that so it would be that kind yeah. of thing i think you know if musicians had a more global outlook mm-hmm. of course you can't hold it against them this may be yeah uh, maybe if you just pin point things in the lyrics it would sound bad yeah but if musicians had a global outlook and especially in a song like this if i think they would be world famous There's a reason I probably didn't hear much of the Grateful Dead growing up. Then I, you know, some uh, some musicians they like being in their zone, yeah. and you know that, that serves them well. Fair enough. They yeah. like that, being in their that's zone. That's there. Yeah, that's there. It makes them comfortable and very gives them fulfilling feeling. Yeah, well. the average the average Indian will eat an Indian meal tonight. Yeah. So I'm assuming the same goes same with an American. Same goes with anybody, anybody. So if you look at it that way, it makes sense. Mm-hmm. But I'm just saying that we can't connect with it if you don't Not know the places. Not wholeheartedly, if you don't. For example, know. Bourbon Street. How many people know. apart from us from India would know what they're talking <laughs> about, unless they've been there. So, or they know through it through documentaries yeah. and television movies. And... Okay, the interesting part was at the end he was done dry trucking. You know, he wanted to go home uh, again, uh, rejuvenate, uh, rekindle, and then probably get ready for another journey. but before that you need a pause after a long 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 trip you want to get back home freshen up one more time gather all your strength one more time uh, and then uh, have another agenda or plan and then get back on the road he wants to be on the road but before that he wants to freshen up going home once and this music is pretty good you know i mean anyone from anywhere in the world will connect with the music will enjoy yeah. the music listening to it a lovely lovely music very well sung vocals and the inspiring message definitely everyone will get mm. they may not connect with the places that easily apart from new york maybe mm. uh, uh, but apart from that i don't think people from outside america and maybe uk canada because uk canada does know a lot yeah. about america yeah people from there yeah. uh, but most other parts they will definitely not know some yeah, of the names yeah. or yeah. mention in the song yeah especially not when the song was probably released in the 70s or 80s yeah that time Now, of actually course, yeah with globalization after the 90s and in today's world where everyone is so well connected more or less but at the same time we have a problem even having a proper conversation with a close friend the in this world where we are so closely connected yes definitely people know more but that time i doubt but it would be difficult it would be difficult for people this has to, to only know. stick to america usa yeah the trucking on also it's a phrase which maybe an american so phrase can, yeah i only got it once the song started you know as you could see from my intro we said what we thought it was about i thought it was it's not a common term it's not a common term but then it turned out to be just moving on you know going on with the show the show must go on kind of thing there was also mention you know at at a point when they are on the road they don't know which place to go they are confused about now which which spot to choose which place to peg and go to it was that kind of uh, decision so they just like being on the road so as simple yeah, as that. it was tough also you know we are looking at the glorified aspect of all these things yeah. it was tough to be on the road for bands and artists it was you know because in those days today it may be a little different especially if you can if you can dictate terms to the labels and the industry 
definitely things may be different for you but in those days not many people had a choice those days we didn't have private planes so, as well these yeah. days we have a lot of them yeah so you i would have to travel with only your band and your management yeah. you know one two people maybe yeah. apart from the band so it was tougher that on the road whoever you met and made friends with and things like that that was a different story but otherwise you were traveling without your loved ones and that split families apart it did actually look at the side effects on me the one of the main reasons many of the classic rock era musicians hmm. were into alcohol hmm. were into drug addiction later on in the 90s drugs came because in because they were trying to cope up with all these because issues. they were on the road they were just trying to forget hmm. you know and get over that loneliness and get over the stress of all that yeah so those are the repercussions of it anyway that's what i have to say about great song anyway is this us as counselors and Layman talking about trying to overanalyze it probably yeah yeah but we do a good job at it <laughs> we do a good job I'm not blowing my own trumpet that's the reality on this platform we try our best when I listen to another reaction possibly to the same song if there is one yeah I do realize we do a phenomenal job Chakin thank you for watching.